Hello, this is Sebastian from Native Instruments. In this video, we will show you how to transfer your tractor collection, playlists and settings from one computer to another. This is possible even if the computers are running different operating systems. In this video, we will be transferring tractor with all its user data, playlists and settings from a Windows system to a Mac. First, we will copy all our music files in the tractor root directory, which contains all your tractor user data, such as your track collection and settings. The easiest way to do this is to copy them to an external hard drive, flash drive or any other mobile storage medium with enough disk space. The default location for the tractor root directory on Windows is C Users Username My Documents Native Instruments, Tractor followed by the version number. On a Mac, it's Macintosh HD, Users, Username, Documents, Native Instruments, Tractor followed by the version number. In this example, the version number is 2.7.3. In case you can't find your Tractor root directory, you can locate it by opening the Preferences in Tractor, choosing File Management and verifying the path set under Root Directory. Now we will copy the Tractor Root Directory onto the external storage medium. In case there are multiple Tractor Root Directories, please make sure to copy only the most recent one. Once your tractor root directory has been copied, we will create a new folder on the external storage medium. Next, we copy all the music files to this folder. Finally, we will copy the Tractor Content folder, which contains all content that you may have created in Tractor. The default path to your Tractor Content folder is your User folder, Music, Tractor. This contains the following subfolders. Content Import, which holds your Remix Deck content. Recordings, which holds any recordings made with Tractor's Mix Recorder. And Samples, which holds all the samples created in Tractor. If you do not find your content here, you may not have generated this content at all, or the paths may differ from the default ones. You can check the individual paths for samples in File Management, Sample Directory, for Remix Set Content in File Management, Remix Set Directory, and for your audio recordings in Mix Recorder Directory. Now we have copied all our music files, the tractor root directory and the tractor content folder onto the external storage medium. Next, on the new system, we start tractor and make sure that the latest version has been installed. Then we open the preferences and go to file management. Make sure that import music folders on startup is not enabled. It is fine to enable this option later on, but not yet. Now we close Tractor. Next, we copy the folder containing all our music files from the external storage medium to the music folder of the internal hard drive. Please note that you can also copy to any other location on your new system. Likewise, we copy the folder containing our Tractor content to the same location where it was on the other computer. Here we are copying the Tractor folder to the default path Username Music. When your operating system asks you if you want to replace the existing folder with a new one, choose Replace. 
The next step is to import the collection. We start Tractor and right click on Track Collection in the browser and choose Import another collection. Now we can browse to the copy Tractor root directory on the external storage medium and select the file collection.nml. Tractor will ask if you wish to import file tags or collection tags. Choose collection to make sure that the metadata saved in the collection will be preserved. Tractor will now import all data from the collection file, such as playlists, cue points, loops, and so on. Likewise, the data from the subfolders, such as transients, stripes, and covers, will be imported. After this, we will have to relocate the tracks by right-clicking Track Collection in the browser and choosing Check Consistency. The consistency check will show a report once it's finished. We go to the Missing Tracks tab and hit Relocate. Now we can direct Tractor to the folder we copied the music files to on the internal hard drive. Once we have located this folder, we click Choose. If your Tractor content folder was copied to a different location than the original one, you will need to relocate this path as well using the Relocate function. Lastly, we will import the Tractor settings. To do this, go to Preferences and click the Import button at the bottom of the window. Browse to the copied Tractor root directory on the external storage medium and select the file tractorsettings.tsi which contains all the settings that the user can adjust in both the Tractor Preferences and the Tractor User Interface. A window called Select Categories to Import will pop up where you can choose which settings to import. Tick all the options except File, Load and Write Paths. In case you are using a different audio device on the new computer, make sure to uncheck Audio Device Settings. Click OK to import the settings. Now we have successfully transferred the Tractor Collection, Playlists and Settings to the new computer.